Over the years, I've had many successful managers confide that they really aren't as good as everyone thinks they are. They feel as if their success rests on a knife's edge. One false move, one tiny mistake, and everyone would know that they were nothing but a well-spoken fraud. This is what's known as the imposter syndrome. Imposter syndrome describes that feeling of strong self-doubt, that you're a fake, that your success is due more to luck or your ability to fool people than it is due to your work, and it often comes along with a fear of being found out. If you let it, imposter syndrome will tie you in knots, ruin your confidence, and undermine your ability to lead your people and achieve your goals, not to mention screw up your life in many other ways. I know. I've been there too. There have been times in my life where I felt as if I didn't belong in that boardroom, didn't think that others would take me seriously, or that I wasn't as smart, as proficient, as musical, or as experienced as I needed to be compared with the group I was working with. The brutal truth is that you can't be the manager you need to be when you're tied up in knots like that. You'll try to overcompensate or you'll stay silent when you should speak. Either one will kill your credibility and end your influence. 